this is why you wash your hair synthetic hair before you put it in your head there is a chemical on the hair that can potentially cause irritation for some however whether it causes irritation or you're not this is what is on synthetic hair all right so thank you for watching so you must have just finished that clip about doing an acv rant on lock hair and that was the i think it was the janet collection maverick lock hair that that um substance was coming off of i still had to take my hair out early because i still had irritation so one of two things i either didn't do a good job of rinsing all the substance off or which is probably the more likely um culprit is that i use free trust um what is that water wave hair whatever that i use for passion twist i use that to wrap um the lock in my braid instead of like inserting the braid in there because i don't know like i could not unravel it but that's what i used to wrap the hair and it was old hair that i used like a while ago and i'm not sure if i did an acv rinse on the hair that i used to wrap so i think that is why because literally like day the next day my scalp started having like a slight irritation it wasn't excessive so i will say that it was manageable but i'm the type of person where i'm like look i'm not dealing with it at all and i remember i got some passion twists using the free trust hair and my scalp was on fire all the time to the point where i started getting like little bumps along my hairline so the reason i posted this video is because it's very important to acv rinse your synthetic hair or purchase the clean therapy hair that uh, i'll show you in a second or that easy braid spectra hair i don't have so i have the easy braid hair in my hair now um, i redid my hair after the locks i think i had my locks in for four days and i took them out um so i just did these last night and there's like plenty of videos on youtube on how to do this because that's basically how i learned how to twist my hair is on youtube and you can even try to figure out how to box braid i did my box braids one time before i gotta work on those a little bit but i was able to get them in my head so <laughs> that's a good thing this is not a hair channel but anyways did this and um so far so good i'm hoping that this is uh, something that some type of hair that i can use all the time there was a sale on sam's beauty so that's why i got it but um yeah if your hairstyle so what, what's the saying the saying is beauty is pain but it shouldn't be that painful right so like you shouldn't be losing your edges you shouldn't be having allergic reactions or rashes or like skin irritations your hair falling out um they use the alkaline base to protect the hair and i guess to make it last i don't know but if there's hair out here that doesn't have it i question why are we still putting it on hair if you know that there it causes like irritation for some so i definitely question why that isn't maybe it's not enough of us but i've seen plenty of videos on youtube about it but um yeah so i will show you guys real quick and this is just like a quick ass video i will actually insert a clip of the clean therapy hair that i'm using it is by free trust which i usually try to stay away from free trust hair because free trust like water wave that passions with hair causes the most irritation of any hair i've ever had in my head um i think i did crochet with it before the itching was freaking excessive i did passion twist with it before I had so many like red bumps on my hair and my ears were like all fucked up from it. My bag had rashes all over me. So I will show it to you. So like edging is normal, you know, with your hair. I mean, but excessive itching is not. So like, oh, my hair is scratch. I'm good for like the whole damn day. But the excessive itching is when you can't stop scratching your head that means there might be a problem with the hair not you so i would just say look into that um but yeah uh here's a clip of the hair 
And if you haven't already, please show your girl some love, like the video, comment, and subscribe.